think of the people working for you as your customer. They are your customer. Their aunts, their uncles, their brothers, their sisters, their friends, their parents, their teachers are your customer. We see this happen in restaurants all the time. They will have a huge employee turnover, and the client will say to us, my turnover is so high, I just keep hiring and firing employees. You know, it's just, they're not any good, so I have to keep getting rid of them. And then I'll say, well, let's look at your sales. Interestingly enough, your sales are trending down. Yeah, it's a bad economy. Is it possible that you fired all your customers? Oh, what do you mean? Well, you keep firing your employees. Your employees keep coming here and some of them quit on their own because they're smart enough to know that you don't know how to run a restaurant. Then they go tell all their brothers and sisters and aunts and uncles, friends and family, loved ones, that you don't know how to clean the kitchen, that you don't know how to take care of food quality, that you don't know how to serve a customer, that you don't know how to treat an employee. So you fired your customer base because they used to work for you. That happens more often than you would think. Now, if you're in a big city like New York or L.A., the reality is, is those cities still have small markets within the big city. Those small markets, those small communities, that's where you're drawing your customers from, and that's where you're drawing your employees from. Or I can go out in the middle of the states, and I can find a small community that just stands on its own. That's where you draw your customers from. That's where you draw your employees from. If the community knows that you're the negative wizard, you're the person that's constantly keeping people down, you're the person that's constantly making people feel bad, making people feel useless, you cannot be successful in that marketplace. And it starts with you being the positive influencer. It starts with you talking to your staff about how they talk to each other. Don't allow the negative wizards inside the business. Get rid of it. It'll impact your sales. It'll impact your sales.